Hi guys, it's Jessie, and today I'm just going to be doing a really easy hairstyle tutorial which was inspired by Carrie Underwood. And the picture I got was out of the new um, May edition of the People's Country Special one. Got it in the grocery store line when I was waiting. But anyway, it had Carrie Underwood in here, and here's her old hairstyle. If you can see it. Got the big bad glare on it. But there it is, her old hairstyle, which would be the longer one with the bangs and it really curly. And then here's her new hairstyle, which is really kind of sleek, straight, and classy. So I really liked this one. So hopefully you can see it. So to get this hairstyle, all I used was a one and a half inch curling iron. And mine's nothing fancy. It's just a Revlon one from Walmart. And then some really light hairspray and then some molding paste. So that's all you need to do this hairstyle. So if you'd like to see how I did this hairstyle, then just keep watching. Okay, to start this hairstyle, I've already blow dried my hair and I just blow dried it straight out with a paddle brush. And I did put a little bit of volumizing mousse through it and I've already sprayed on some Salon Straight. Um, this one's from Mark. It's just a style protector, a heat protectant. So to start this, we're gonna um, have to part off our hair and to do this, I'm going to try to do it so you can see it. She's kind of got the, if you can see it, it's kind of at a diagonal. So we're going to have to, and my hair is kind of already parted this way. Comb it over. And then just section it out. Comb back what needs to be combed back. So there we go. Kind of brushing my bangs out of the way for this. All right, so I'm just going to pull out my hair because you're going to, um, Use your one and a half inch curling iron to curl this under in small sections. So I'm just going to section my hair up in two different sections. Ew, there's the bangs back in the eyeball. Okay, so I'm going to leave down a little bit of hair on the bottom because you just wanted to do thin partings and get this curled under. So you clip this up. All right, and you're going to take your curling iron. Let's see if I can see on camera while I'm looking at the mirror. You're just going to take it all the way to the end, and you're going to curl it under. And if you have longer hair, you just want to curl the very ends under. My hair is about ooh, shoulder length. And you're going to let it go. Just like that. And then take the next section. Mine, I normally curl mine in like three sections because my hair... That's how my hair ends up with this curling iron. And depending on how hot your curling iron gets, how long you need to leave it in. This one's just the Revlon one, you can see that, from Walmart. And it actually gets pretty hot. I'm gonna curl this section under. Ouch. Okay, so I've got that curled. And after I curl mine, I just take, um, this one is the TG Rockaholic, their uh, hairspray in the orange can. I don't know, can't remember what all colors they come in, but I like this one because it's not very heavy. And I just spray each one of them. So to save um, some time so this video isn't extremely long, I'm going to go ahead and curl mine under. You're just going to keep working in small, thin sections all the way up. And I'm going to go ahead and curl mine under, and then I'll come back and show you how to fix the bangs and how to fix the rest of the hair after we have it curled under.